Royce. Even though we've been together for a long time, this day was not just eight years in the making. This has been many, many more years in the making. As kids, our parents raised us with the values we hold dear. And as young adults, we defined ourselves as independent individuals even before we met. Marriage goes beyond the two people. It spans generations and lasts lifetimes. It has me thinking on our grandparents and our parents and puts into perspective how big this day really is. This moment has been our lives and the lives of our families in the making. Today is the joining of our past apart and our future together. I am so glad that I'm here with you today and I'm even more excited for our future together. Love you, Royce. now I've told you how sure I was of us and how when we first made eye contact I instantly felt connected I fell in love in two weeks and just knew in my heart that we would end up together despite the distance I didn't know it was possible for time to stand still and move fast all at the same time I didn't think it was possible to love a complete stranger let alone four other people and yet I love your family now I didn't know you would be as supportive as you are of my career, and you are constantly lifting me up and helping me grow, and I would not be where I am without you and your support. You're the simplest and most complex person in my life. You challenge me, you make me laugh, you make me feel loved. I'm more myself when I'm with you, and when I wake up in the morning before you do, I look at the sunrise in your face and I feel blessed. And when it's Sunday night and the weekend we spent together is nearing its end, I feel a little sad. And when you laugh, I always look at your cheeks and your eyes and I hope that when we have kids, they have your traits. Today I realize that my love for you has no bounds. I love you forever, John Hayden. And I can't wait to marry you today. the honor and privilege of introducing to you now for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. John and Royce Haig. John, take you, Roy's, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. I, Roy's, take you, John, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. Thank you. 
John told me that he will propose to Royce, I told him, John, just don't hurt my baby. Then John said, Tito, I will never hurt Royce. And I, I was very happy that day. Royce is very loving and caring daughter. I always wanted to be with her. That's why when she lived in uh, Berkeley for school, I always cry on my way home after visiting her. My sunshine, my baby panganay Royce, thank you for being an awesome daughter. I love you so much, Anna. John, you are officially my son in love. It's easy to be loved by all the members of our family. Just love and take care of Royce with all your family. I remember my father in hope told me, Saldi, no return, no exchange, all right? My name is Renee, and I'm Royce's best friend from college. Friend really doesn't sum up the role that Royce has played in my life. She's always been more like a sister to me. Um, she grabs life for the taking. She runs full steam ahead towards her dreams, and she masterfully creates them. She's a fierce worker, and she doesn't let a lot of people in, but when she does, she really loves them. John, you make Royce a better person. You make her happy, and you make her healthy for loving her and thank you for taking care of her. My brother is the best brother in the world. <laughs> of all the experiences we shared when we were growing up, there was one that really stood out to me. It was our school spelling bee. And I had just made the finals where my brother was waiting for me. I wasn't feeling very confident. After all, how was I supposed to win against the best brother in the world? But surprisingly, uh, he slipped up, and I sealed my victory by spelling the word equator. <laughs> E-Q-U-A-T-O-R. <laughs> You're the best brother in the world. Thanks for always having my back. I, uh, I wish I had the words to describe just how special our bond used to be. But really, there's nothing in the world that equates to it. Remember Royce and Jan, put God first always in everything you do. Your patience, respect, understanding, love to one another will hold you tight together for the rest of your life. Thank you so much for coming to celebrate this very memorable day to us, especially to Royce and Jan. We love you all.